Hi guys, I'm Woodcraft Hamster and I thought I would do another video um, carving some coffee scoops today. Slightly different design to what I've been doing recently so I thought it might be of interest. Um, and also what I wanted to show you was how easy it was to sort of make something out of a fairly small piece of wood like this. You know, this is a half round, it was only kind of, I don't know, maybe four inches round at the very most anyway. Um, and a lot of people will kind of turn their nose up at that kind of with the, oh it's not big enough, can't do much with it. Um, but actually I think you can and that's what I'm hoping to show you today. Um, I've marked out a couple of little scoops in there, um, little bit to connect them just so I know roughly where the handles are going to go and I've also put a couple of little small holes either side so that I can secure it down to my workbench just to get the bowl set in. Um, so that's what I'm going to be doing today, I will move the camera a little bit closer in and we'll make a start. Right then guys, so that's now secured down to the bench and not moving anywhere. And to start off with, I'm just going to use my gouge um, and I just want to sort of roughly set these bowls in and then I'll move over to something else to tidy them up. Um, and really, the reason I like to secure this down to the bench like this, you know, make sure you've got a bit of waste wood to put your screw holes in, but I prefer this over my vice because I can come, kind of come all the way around my bench, get to it from every angle, whereas if I put it on my vice, you know, I just can't can't quite get behind it if I need to get to the side that's actually facing the bench and um, so that's why I do it but anyway I am going to get these bowls set in I'll skip through this footage for you um, and we'll see where we get to Now, for the time being, guys, that's all I'm going to do with the gouge. You can do more with it, don't get me wrong, but I'm just going to move this to one side and grab my Twicker cam. Now, this is the smaller of the two, and I find this works really well for kind of scooping round and getting a nice kind of round bowl. Um, so I'm going to do this for probably a few more minutes, and I'll just see how far we get. So there you go guys, a few minutes work and we've got some reasonably round, I mean I need to do a little bit more work on these but these are pretty good so far. Um, if I just bring the camera a little bit closer in for you, bear with me. Hopefully you can see there, you know, these are nice and smooth on the inside, not 100% round but I can tidy those up as I say. Um, and yeah, all in all I'm pretty pleased with that so far. So there we go guys, probably 10-15 minutes worth of work and the bowls are now as I want them. A little bit of sanding to do later, um, but this is still green wood so it needs to dry out. And the last thing I want to do today is just take off the excess where we've got these screw holes because we no longer need that um, and I'll do that quickly now. So there you go guys, that's now finished for today. I'll come back probably next week to this and we'll do a bit of axe work and start refining these down. Um, but uh, yeah, so hopefully it was useful to you guys. Comment in the questions in the box below. Hit like and subscribe if you'd like to see more and I hope you'll all join me next time. Cheers guys.